it because we got even better, like not better news. Well, I guess he'll say better bigger, news. I mean, bigger, bigger news. news. Bigger news. We saw it with Xbox last year and then it went on Game Pass. It is going to be on Game Pass this year. They already announced that. Day one. There is bigger news than that. It is coming to Nintendo Switch. And I, I, I think this was supposed to be happening last year because remember Nintendo kind of posted a, a tweet when they announced it going to a different console and stuff like that, but it just never came to fruition. Uh, now it is and now it's here so i am for me that's a nintendo switch owner i'm finally gonna be able to do moments here kooks <laughs> that's all i'm gonna say he's sitting on the couch watching a movie and just just, just you watching know, the mech game man just watching knock out game. knock out some tops nows you know yeah. um now it's so cool man i i 100 with you i think this was supposed to happen for 21 the pandemic and you know the the working conditions and how things were going, it probably just was a better idea for them to say, let's hold off till 22, make sure we get this right. Cause the last thing we want to do is our first year on a console, release a rush product and kind of have a bad reputation to start off. So um, I think it was the right move. And, you know, it's, it's, it's going to be like playing MLB, the show, the old games on the PSP again, like being able to have that handheld uh, experience and, you know, cross progression, cross saves, all that stuff. You know, we're going to talk about that a little bit too. Like just adding all of those elements together, it has never been easier and more accessible to play MLB the show ever. And it is the perfect year for this to happen. Oh, without a doubt. And with a tiny on the cover, we all know how, I guess, the Nintendo base does globally. I mm -hmm. mean, I, that might be even more popular than with Xbox and PS5 globally, just the accessibility of uh, the Switch currently now especially how the next gen consoles are still struggle to get so this is going to bring a bigger i mean this is going to be the biggest game base user base that we ever had we thought that last year yeah to find out yeah, this it, year it, it's exponential this year it's crazy and, uh, and now, now now to think about it with nintendo switch we gotta bring it up we gotta bring it up it's not gonna have creative stadiums which i i don't think i don't consider nintendo switch like a next gen console no. i see it more just up above i guess a one and a ps4 like similar to that would that make yeah. sense no yeah 100 yeah, so but either way it's handheld and you get to play with that now we I, we all call the xbox br runs you know you know people are going shooting for br oh this is gonna be an easy way to get get my flawless runs now we call the mickey mouse runs for br right what will we call nintendo switch now Mario runs? Super Mario runs? <laughs> what, what do you call it? I mean, I feel like Super Mario, I mean, sometimes that game could be hard. Sometimes it could be. What if it, you have Mario Maker or stuff like that, those crazy levels? I, I, don't, I don't think the Super Mario does justice. That's true. That's true. I, I don't know. I don't know enough don't know. Nintendo property to, to, to make that <laughs> same, same connection. But now, nah, yeah, it, that's just going to be so cool to be able to experience diamond dynasty on yet another platform because we've played mlb the show 21 on both xbox and yeah. playstation and you actually made a tweet the other day saying the timing windows on xbox are much different and i'm 100 percent in agreement with you. you nobody can convince me that the timing windows on xbox and the timing windows on playstation are the same um and so i'm curious to see if that's going to be another element to throw in there when we're playing the game on switch because there is going to have to be an adjustment i'm curious what the game will run like how many frames it's going to be. I, I don't even know what the switch gets to. Cause I mean, Nintendo is more about like the social gaming experience than hardcore performance, I think. So I, and you know, think about it, like think about how also how the Nintendo switch is set up where you have the two joy cons. You could just literally put that Nintendo switch down, give one person a joy con, give the other person a joy con and you can play head to head MLB the show with your friend right there on the couch with the little switch screen. Like it's just, yeah, it's going to be so cool, man. I'm, I'm so excited. <laughs>